a great start to the weekend here as we've got baseball from Yankee Stadium in the Bronx. Tonight, game two of this four-game weekend set between the Chicago White Sox and the New York Yankees. The two men you see there go head-to-head. -head. Coming up next... Coming to the plate now, number 87. First time to the plate for him, and he's coming off, of course, an outstanding three home run effort yesterday. First pitch coming, here it is. Pulled toward right center field. And this is taken in shy the bag, of the track, the but the runner will tag from second. And he'll get into third here on the flyout, so he's 90 feet away here with one gone. With that, it's time to check out the starting lineup for the hometown Yankees. Danny, who stands out to you? Look, Matt, everybody should be looking at the guy in the three spot. He's coming off a big performance, three home runs. You start trying to figure out how you pitch around him. When you start hitting three home runs in a game, you start getting attention real quick. Now at the plate, Carmen Gonzalez, 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Carmen. Good. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. Two, two, two. Softly hit down to third, likely no shot at two. There's one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two, and it gets him out of the inning. Around the horn they go. 5 to 4 to 3 to end the threat. We're back to Friday Night Baseball on the show after this. Now batting, number 87. 0 for 1 Yankees. here in the early going. The third baseman. Number 87. First pitch of the at bat. Is swung on and driven out to right center field. A ball that's well hit. Gone! Big dogs got to eat. Solo shot to right center. Fourth home run here in the early going. As the Yankees move out in front here, it's now 3-2. to two. I guess the pitchers haven't been talking in the dugout because it looks like they've learned nothing about this guy. He's torched them for four home runs this series, and they're still giving him pitches to hit. So it's a runner at first with two Adam. gone. Okay. And up next will be Willie Adamas. Willie Adamas. Slow Here's little roller to third. Throw in time and the side is retired. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. Last half of the fifth coming up, and we are all tied at three apiece. So stepping in, number 87 he comes in Yankee. one for two with that home run he hit man. earlier. In the last number at that, Matty D, we heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. Goal! Big dogs got to eat! So a solo shot here to left center field, his second of the game as they take the lead four to three. Guys, we've seen four big balls between the two teams so far today. What are your impressions of the long ball display we're watching? Yeah, man, you don't see this very often, do you? Digging in to try it again. Number 87. Number 87. He comes in two for three with a couple of home runs thus far on his line. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Hey, boys, you talk about getting your ace. Tried to crush that ball, and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. A 
Looking for the K. Here's the pitch. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Ramirez recovers. And makes the throw to first. Two down. Ready for another chance. Willie Adamas. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his one, one, one. bat right here. The double play is in order. The ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. And the throw will come to first, so the sacrifice works as planned. Riding into the box, now number back. 87. Number He's gone 87. deep twice in the game, making him two for four. First pitch coming, here it is. Drilled there you go. First. Stand up. Stand up. And he rips on it as this ball's right under his glove. And the runner from second will stay put right at there. third. So they're runners at the corners now with one away. Hey, guys, I think the pitcher was just trying to steal a strike right there. I do not think he expected to get ambushed on an oh, oh, get me over breaking ball. But that's exactly what happened. Now that the left fielder. So now it'll Javier. be the four hole hitter, Javier Peniagua. And they're runners at the corners now. And that's low ball four. That's a big no no. He obviously had to work carefully with two men on, but he did not want to walk him to load the bases. Now he's really got his work cut out for him. We'll see how he fares here. Into the box, Omar Feliz. He'll try to follow right up the double in his Omar. last at bat with another big hit Feliz. right here. Yeah, it's been an offensive explosion Feliz. for him today. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everyone seems to be putting barrel on baseball in this lineup. So he sets him down swinging. Omar Feliz becomes the second game. out of the bottom of the, the seventh. Baseman. I'm really impressed Andy. by that strikeout, and I'll Feliz. tell you why. He should have gotten a call on the pitch before. And threw right. it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. So all in all, they're fortunate to give up just three in the inning as they wind up escaping the bases loaded jam. We'll look ahead to inning number eight now. It's the Yankees 10 and the White Sox 4. Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with a victory and look on to the next one. 10 to 4, the final in this game. The New York Yankees wrote an important sixth inning to victory in this one. Benny Irizarry claims the win out of the pen his first. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter at MLB The Show.